New at noon, we're now hearing what the hospital has to say about this scary incident. This happened early this morning at Florida Hospital East on Lake Underhill Road. Mark Lehman is there with more. Today we're told all operations are back to normal here at Florida Hospital East, but there were definitely some very tense and frightening moments inside. Deputies say they acted very quickly, responding to a call of a man armed with a gun and a knife. I woke up with my girlfriend and I heard a shooter in a building, a shooter in a building. That terrifying announcement echoing over the PA system just after 2 this morning. Chalmer Gross, whose girlfriend is a patient, says that was followed by confusion. Yeah, it kind of blew my mind when I walked out. I was like, wow, what's really going on? Investigators say a worker first spotted a man waving a gun and making suicidal threats. That prompted an active shooter scenario as deputies assessed the situation. Because we didn't know what we had initially when we got here until we were able to get up there, see him, you know, make eye contact with him. Did we know what we had? Doing a room by room search, deputies tracked down the man who they say is an elderly patient with dementia. He was then quickly taken into custody with the help of hospital security. During the incident, um, you know, he was very distraught and but fortunately, very fortunately, no one was injured. The hospital did go on lockdown. Investigators were covering a handgun and a knife, but they say the man never threatened anyone other than himself. He also has no prior criminal history. After the lockdown was lifted, deputies say the patient was being cared for by medical staff, but was not injured at any point during this incident. Right now, deputies say the investigation is ongoing. For now, reporting in Orlando, Mark Lehman, News 6. All right, Mark, thank you. Deputies tell us it's unclear how the patient got a hold of the weapons. And just into our newsroom, Florida Hospital released a statement reading in part, quote, as of this morning, the patient has been moved to a different room, is guarded by security personnel, and is being further evaluated by medical staff. For more about what the hospital had to say, we have the full statement online right now. Just look for the story on the homepage of clickorlando.com.